Hello everyone. Welcome to Go Charting Primer series in English. So in the last few videos, we have explained you about the order flow settings, how to get the order flow charts, how to get the bar statistics, how to get the delta indicator, and what are the related settings. Now we will start studying the charts systematically. So we will start from the top left, and we will slowly learn about this top bar. Then we will learn about this bottom bar, and then we will learn about these. widget bars and also the toolbar okay so that is how we will go and we'll learn things step by step so this series is for those traders who are very new to go charting so this is our effort to familiarize them with go charting quickly so let's start with the profile section so if you click on this top left there will be your name initial or there will be your photograph so first thing you will be able to see is your email id so this is very important friends what happens suppose you have taken the subscription of go charting and you have paid for a plan but somehow you have logged in by a different email id and in that case you will not be able to see the live data so friends make sure that the email id by which you have logged in is the same which is shown here now second here if you click on you will see your profile section and this will show your billing section so let's go to billing section now this billing section is very important friends here you will be able to see all the plans which are activated in your account if you have bought any third party indicators that will also be shown here now i want to tell you about this change option what is this change option friends you know we have various plans suppose we have us equity we have us cme premium we also have india nse premium we also have india mcx premium we have crypto and forex plan so suppose you have taken india all premium but now you want to shift to crypto and forex so what you have to do you have to click on here and once you click on here you will get these boxes so suppose right now you are in india all premium but you want usa so what you will do you will uncheck this and you will click here and you will check these and then you will go and proceed to check out so your plan will get changed and the amount you have paid it will be adjusted based on the number of days you have used your plan so this was important information about the billing section now this will also show you whatever plans you have subscribe to so these are the plans we have subscribed now this option is for chat help so friends if you switch it on there will be a chat help option always visible to your chart so during live market if you face any problem you simply click on this chat section and we are always there to help you during live markets so you can click on this chat now you can fill your details right now the market is closed so it is showing as offline you can fill all your details and will be able to help you during the live market you can also send us offline messages which will be replying in the evening now here we have this important section which is called hide bottom bar so first let me show you what is the bottom bar friends this is bottom bar here we have multiple chart layout and we have this uh, save template option all these laser section everything is there so suppose what happens so this bottom bar may take extra space for your chart so some traders want to hide it so you can hide this bottom bar now you can see the chart size has increased and the bottom bar is hidden however at the same time you are not able to see the multi chart layout options so we get many complaints that we are not getting the multi chart layout option so friends make sure that you have clicked here and you have to unhide the bottom bar okay so that is one important thing friends let me also tell you you will also not get this multi chart layout in case of options desk which is our second product so if you want to access the multi chart layout make sure that you are in the chart section not in the options desk if you go to options desk you will not get the multi chart layout functions now let me talk about the hide toolbar so what is the toolbar friends this is our toolbar here we have all the drawing tools so if you want to hide it we can click on hide and it is hidden so basically these options are just to increase your chart size so that you can easily read the order flow because it requires a lot of screen space now let me unhide it now we have another option it is called widget bar so friends this 
column is called widget bar here you will find all your widgets so you can see it either in left or you can see it in right so currently it is in the right side if i click on the left widget bar it has come to the left now you can also hide this widget bar and the toolbar by this arrow option if you click on this it is hidden and if you click on this it is again hidden and if you want to unhide it you just simply click on this arrow so this was about your profile section from the next video onwards we will start learning about the top bar and all those settings in a systematic way thank you guys